Aside from the chaos in Florida, Irma has left a trail of death and destruction across the Caribbean. Even parts of Cuba, which is well prepared for hurricanes, have been hit hard. We have nothing. We lost everything. The refrigerator, the washing machine, we lost everything here. To the east on the French territory of St. Martin, there's been looting and violence as supplies have run dangerously low. In response, France upped the number of troops it's sending there and to St. Barthélemy. The government has rejected criticism. It's been slow to act. But many islanders say they feel abandoned and desperate. Now security forces are handing out much needed aid and helping people as they begin to take stock of the damage. People are helping each other, putting boards up to clear and clean. Yesterday we cleaned the streets, so yes, there is solidarity here. The UK is facing criticism, but it has been slow to respond to desperate pleas for help from some of its overseas territories, including the British Virgin Islands and Anguilla. But Foreign Minister Boris Johnson has defended the relief efforts. We've been discussing the situation in uh, the overseas territories where things continue to be very grim indeed, but we're getting a, a huge amount of aid in there. While some aid is coming in, it could take years for these islands to recover. Arabella Munro, TRT World.